This video is for educational purposes only. Our goal is to inform and empower you, not to encourage any illegal or unethical behavior. We do not condone or encourage any illegal activity. Everything discussed here is meant to raise awareness and help you stay safe in the digital world. Today, we're pulling back the curtain to expose the top 10 most dangerous hacking tools used by both ethical hackers and cyber criminals alike. These tools are powerful, versatile, and can be used for both good and bad purposes. Number 10 on our list is Metasploit, often called the Swiss Army Knife of Hacking, and for good reason. This tool is legendary in the cybersecurity world, used by both ethical hackers and cybercriminals alike. Metasploit is a massive open source framework packed with thousands of exploits, payloads, and auxiliary modules. It allows hackers and security professionals to probe, test, and attack vulnerabilities in computer systems with incredible efficiency. Think of it as a digital crowbar or a master key, point it at a target, and it systematically searches for weak spots. Once it finds a vulnerability, it can launch a variety of exploits to gain unauthorized access, escalate privileges, or even take full control of a system. Hackers use Metasploit to scan entire networks, identify outdated servers, and exploit weaknesses. This can lead to stealing sensitive data, installing backdoors, or spreading malware across an organization. What's fascinating is that Metasploit is publicly available and was originally designed to help security experts test and improve defenses. But like any powerful tool, it's a double-edged sword, used for both good and bad. So what's the best defense against Metasploit attacks? It's simple but crucial. Keep your systems updated at all times. Metasploit primarily targets known vulnerabilities, those security holes that have already been discovered and documented. By regularly patching your software, you close the windows that hackers are constantly searching for. Don't just update your operating system. Make sure your browser, apps, plugins, and any other software you use are always running the latest versions. Every update is a step towards stronger security. Don't give attackers an easy way in. Use strong passwords, enable two-factor authentication, and review your security settings regularly. Patch your systems, stay vigilant, and you're already ahead of most cyber threats. With good habits, you can turn the tables on hackers and keep your digital world safe. Number 9 is Nmap, the ultimate reconnaissance tool. Before an attack, hackers need a map of the network. Nmap provides it. It scans for devices, open ports, and services, revealing what's running and where the weak spots are. Nmap is the first step in almost every network hack, used by both hackers and network admins. It's so iconic, it's even featured in movies like The Matrix. Defending against Nmap means closing unnecessary ports and services and using a properly configured firewall. Security pros use Nmap on their own networks to see what hackers would see. Make your network a blank wall, block what you don't need. The less you expose, the safer you are. Number 8 on our list is Wireshark, the world's most popular and powerful network protocol analyzer. It's a tool used by professionals and hobbyists alike to peer into the very heart of network traffic. Imagine being able to see every single piece of data traveling across a network, emails, passwords, images, and even the websites people visit. Wireshark makes this possible by capturing and displaying all the raw data packets that move through a network, breaking them down into readable information. On unsecured networks, Wireshark becomes the ultimate eavesdropping tool. Anyone with access can silently watch the digital conversations happening all around them, often without the users ever knowing. Hackers love public Wi-Fi for this reason. If you're connected to an open network at a coffee shop or airport, someone running Wireshark nearby can capture your traffic and potentially see sensitive information, unless it's encrypted. While security professionals use Wireshark for legitimate purposes like troubleshooting network issues or analyzing suspicious activity, attackers use it to passively gather intelligence and hunt for vulnerabilities. The best defense against this kind of spying? Strong encryption. Always use HTTPS websites and consider a VPN to scramble your data before it leaves your device. These tools create a secure tunnel, making your information unreadable to anyone trying to intercept it. Even if someone manages to capture your network traffic, encryption ensures that what they see is just a jumble of meaningless code, completely unreadable and useless to them. Always check for the padlock icon in your browser's address bar and avoid using public Wi-Fi without protection. These small steps can make a huge difference in keeping your data safe. Encryption is like turning your personal information into a locked box. Only you and the intended recipient have the key to open it. So, stay invisible to prying eyes. 
protect your privacy, and make sure your data remains yours alone. Number seven is John the Ripper, a legendary password cracking tool. It takes stolen password hashes and tries to figure out the original passwords using dictionary and brute force attacks. Hackers feed it millions of possible passwords and it cracks weak ones in seconds. If your password is simple or common, it's toast. Once cracked, those passwords can be used for credential stuffing, trying the same login on other sites. The lesson use long, complex, unique passwords for every account. A password manager can help you generate and store strong passwords. Don't reuse passwords. One breach shouldn't compromise everything. Strong passwords are your best defense. Don't make it easy for John the Ripper. Number six is Aircrack Ang, the Wi-Fi password cracker. It captures Wi-Fi traffic, grabs the handshake when a device connects, and then tries to crack the password offline. With a cheap Wi-Fi adapter and this free tool, anyone can attempt to break into nearby networks. Once inside, attackers can see your devices and intercept your traffic. The fix? Use WPA2 or WPA3 security and set a long, random Wi-Fi password. Never use WEP, it's obsolete and easily cracked. Don't use obvious passwords like your name or 12345678. The longer and more random, the better. Protect your digital home with strong Wi-Fi security. Don't let air cracking in. Number five is Hydra, the master of online brute force attacks. Unlike John the Ripper, Hydra attacks live login forms, websites, email, remote desktop, and more. It tries thousands of username and password combinations in parallel, looking for a way in. One weak password is all it takes for a hacker to get access. Defend with account lockout policies, lock accounts after several failed attempts. Multi-factor authentication is critical. Even if Hydra cracks your password, it can't get past the second factor. Use strong, unique passwords for every account. Don't let Hydra find a way in. Lock down your logins. MFA and strong passwords stop brute force attacks cold. Number four is SQL Map, the king of exploiting SQL injection vulnerabilities. It automates the process of finding and exploiting weak spots in website databases. Hackers use it to steal user data, passwords, credit cards, everything stored in a vulnerable database. One flaw can lead to millions of records being stolen. The defense is on developers use parameterized queries and secure coding practices. As a user, use unique passwords for every site. If one is breached, others stay safe. SQL map makes database attacks easy, so secure coding is essential. Developers must build security in from the start. One mistake can be catastrophic. Don't let your data be an easy target. Number three is Burp Suite, the command center for web hackers. It intercepts and modifies traffic between your browser and a website, letting attackers test for vulnerabilities and manipulate data. Burp Suite can automate attacks, brute force logins, and scan for flaws like SQL injection and XSS. It's the industry standard for penetration testers and a favorite of black hats. Defense is up to developers, validate all input on the server side and never trust data from the browser. Secure coding and regular testing are key. Burp Suite exposes weak spots, don't leave any. Build security into every web app. Test your own sites before hackers do. Stay one step ahead. Number two is the Social Engineer Toolkit or SET. This tool targets people, not software, automating phishing, fake websites, and malicious files. SET can clone login pages, craft convincing emails, and trick users into giving up credentials. It's a complete arsenal for social engineering attacks. Defense is all about awareness. Be skeptical, check sender addresses, and hover over links before clicking. Never enter credentials on suspicious sites. Multi-factor authentication adds a crucial layer of protection. Security training is essential. Humans are the first line of defense. Don't fall for digital cons. Stay alert and question everything. Number one is Kane and Abel, a classic all-in-one password recovery tool for Windows. Once inside a network, Kane can sniff traffic, extract passwords, and launch man-in-the-middle attacks like ARP poisoning. It intercepts everything. Passwords, session cookies, sensitive data. Kane can also crack password hashes using brute force, dictionary, and rainbow table attacks. While less effective on modern networks, it's still a threat on poorly secured systems. Defense, use strong encryption, detect ARP poisoning, and enforce strong password policies. Don't let attackers move freely inside your network. Secure every layer. Remember, this video is for educational purposes only. Stay safe online and use your knowledge responsibly. We've shown you 10 of the most powerful hacking tools out there. Security is a process. Keep systems updated, use strong passwords, enable multi-factor authentication, and stay vigilant. You're the human firewall. Your actions matter most. Take these steps, and you'll block most attacks. If you found this helpful, subscribe for more cybersecurity content.
Thanks for watching. Stay safe. See you next time.